Hello again, squaddies. Welcome back once again to Randota, as always, I am D, and we're going to be back in Underlords here for today. Mostly because I wanted to make the announcement that, yep, we're into open beta now. This is now in early access. Anybody can get to this now, as far as I can tell. So let's just go ahead. They also have the tutorial, which you can do. We're going to just run through this real quick to have you guys. Actually, you know what? Beef them up. You don't actually have to drag. I mean, they did make that, so. Yep. Anyways, we're just going to run through the tutorial. If you need, you can pause the video to read any of the messages. But you've seen me play this before for two weeks, so. You also get fireworks now when you win. Uh, I'm gonna take the gloves of haste for this. Yep, three duplicate heroes into a powerful two star hero. But it's only up to. You know what? We're actually gonna. We're gonna lock that so I can get axe next round. So he's now a two star and he also hits faster. Finishes it with style. Uh, take Birch the Martyr. There we go. Oh, I forgot to give it to Shadow Shaman. Well, actually, it'd be better to give it to Axe, come to think of it, because he doesn't... Shadow Shaman should not be taking damage. There we go. Ooh, let's go ahead and take the Lycan and the Chaos Knight. We're going to swap out for the... Saw that for the Lycan on the front row. Also give him the sword. Because Lycan gets summon wolves, but he also shapeshifts when he does it, so. Like I said, we're just running through the tutorial today, so. There we go. They also put in, there is also a beta season, so you can play that. Where is it? You can heal, you can buy XP if you want. Five gold gets you four XP. We're basically going, I'm going full tilt front line here. Not the best strategy in the world, but we'll see if it works out. I mean, I'm pretty sure the tutorials are on easy mode, so... That was easy enough. Crystal Maiden. That's all the units I want. I could have picked up a Terror Blade, but that would not have helped because I have a demon already. In the form of the Chaos Knight.
Like, you know what? Sell those. Pick up a keeper. And hold it there. All right, we're gonna swap the Shadow Shaman out for the Keeper. Two humans, all humans gain 20% chance to silence target when attacking. Sell the Shadow Shaman, actually. Spin the wheel. Lock that, so I can get the Lycan. So he gets Illuminate. But he's never gonna build it up because it takes him a long time. Take the lichen. You know what? No. Going. <laughs> they also did change this up a little bit. You can kill one lichen, but I've got a second one. Oh yeah, I just saw these are on easy. Chaos Knight. Lichen. the second axe out. So we've got three level twos out. We're up to the first intermission. These items that need to be quit and automatically take effect. Take the tusk. Ugh, hold on. I will take the kanka. I'm gonna go and let this go real quick and go to what my cat just found. like another win I wasn't actually watching but my cat found something that I don't know where she got it from you know what let's take keeper off put Kunkka on the board like I said full tilt on the front lines
to X. And the only support unit I've got, technically. This is going well so far. We actually gotta illuminate off. I lost the keeper, but I had to check because my cat made a noise and I don't want them getting hurt. I've got two cats. They're fun. Okay, let's see. Second Kunkka. There, so onwards. This round I'll probably just pick up some XP. And they're just gonna swarm my keeper who managed to get Illuminate Blast off, but not a strong one. And now the wolf gets mobbed by everything. Still alive, that is. Tusk almost died. How strong are those wolves? That's the reason I got that is so I can get the keep the keeper. Ooh, never mind. Another level two lichen. Lock that so I can get my neck so I can get another two star Chaos Knight. I lose my demon effect. So that's because they have a demon hunter. Now they have the terror blade. We lose anybody? Nope. Not this time. Chaos Knight. Myself even closer to my to my level up. I do like the fact that Terra Blades ability is to basically screw probably screw over one of your own guys. Okay. Start building towards my next Chaos Knight. Get my axe. And my next axe. And I can lock in there so I can get the next tusk. You know what? Another two star Chaos Knight. He's gonna get the gem. Actually, wait, no. Bridge the Aggressor is gonna go to Kunkka. Let's go ahead and sell the, the keeper. This is quite a fun game, even though I'm intentionally doing a stupid tactic. It's like, oh hey, you want to attack my back line? Congrats, it's also my front line.
Actually, you know what? Uh, swap you places, swap you two places. Not a two stop. Get into Lycan. So that I can start getting a three star. Get close to getting a three star. How am I doing on experience? This might give me the level of height I wanted. That's gonna hit all of them, except the Terror Blade. Alrighty. This will get me to my next level, definitely. <laughs> let's get, the wolves get some just as the thing, just as the potato died. So far, I was the one who won that, I think. We're gonna sell the tusk, grab the lichen, lock that so I can get the. Actually, no. Uh, sell the axes. Level three lichen. Kunkka, you're going on the end there. Actually, no. Place you with a tusk. You're still going on the end, but it's gonna be Kunkka, Chaos Knight. Yeah, it's not he's not axe, but This is a tanky as hell lineup. I forgot to give out the sacred relic. So I can get a Chaos Knight next round. I think you actually get more experience if you're low level, if you are doing worse. Queen got the scream up just as Tusk punched her into the air. That so I can get Kunkka, a uh, two star Kunkka on my next round. Nobody's died yet, and we're on round twenty four. That's kind of surprising. Alright, two star Kunkka. I see, I get one more Chaos Knight and I've got a tier 3.
Oof. Tyrol is going to go out pretty soon at this rate. I mean, it's not a big deal. There we go. Lock that in. Actually. And unlock that. So I've got a tier 3 Chaos Knight. anybody? No, we didn't. Let's grab a Daedalus. It's an experience, not that I need it really. Alright, Daedalus is going to go on Lycan. Sword is going to go on Tusk. I am actually technically a unit short. took another hit hit from me I guess this is ooh there we go that actually gives us the night counter as well so anybody within a square of my two knights Wait, no. Oh, wait, no, it's nice to clear everything else. Okay, so they have to be one away from each other. And that's the end of the front line I need. We get the Troll Warlord. So I gain a level and I can use all of them. <laughs> you know, let's actually rearrange this a little bit. So we've got the knights going. Anders is out. Eight level, it takes being level 8 to get the full line. Still not losing people. Get my second Dragon Knight, lock in for the Troll Warlord for next round. Still, we're, we've made it to 30 rounds. Radiance, done. Lock that so I can get to Kunkka. And put Dragon Knight with the Radiance. I've only fought Athena once. Troll almost died, but not quite. Uh. 
so at a three star troll warlord can hit for 300% attack speed at, mo at maximum stacks All right, lock that in so we can get a troll warlord next time let's keep going though we're up to 32 I think this is the highest round number I've gotten to ever either I'm dead by now or somebody else is or everybody, or everybody else is Yeah, we lost two people. We lost the Dragon Knight, and we lost Tusk. One of them. Four people just went out. Tyrol's actually pulled off a seven, or seven round win streak. Athena is out. Pick up the axe. Pick up the Kanka. Actually, no, this can't be the highest I've ever been to because I don't remember. We haven't fought the dragon yet. Saul took 20 damage on one attack. Here we go. This is it. This is not the highest, but I'm not sure I've ever made it to. Four. I'm not sure if anybody's ever survived to forty. There we go. At least not anybody I've ever. Not any of the games I've ever played. Let's take Daedalus, another Daedalus, this time going to troll. Eh, you know what? Goodbye, Tyrol. I have to swap over to his perspective and see what he's up again. Actually, I can't. Alright then. It might be because this is the, 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 uh, this is the tutorial. Tyrol is out. Saul has 4 HP left, so I've basically got this unless I take everything down. Saul somehow manages to hold on here. Oop, I forgot to start the actual map. Mission, the actual level. There you go. That is easily. That is just really the tutorial for Underlords. If you enjoyed, feel free to drop a like on the video. You can also leave a comment down below if you have anything you'd like to say. If you want to keep up with me and my current series, then consider joining the squad or subscribe to the channel. It does help me out, and I really do appreciate it. As for that squaddies, I have been D. This is now an open beta, and I look forward to seeing more people play this. Until next time. Good night, and good gaming.